So here I'm in my Slack channel, general. Now let's see how we can work around with channel options and see the permissions that we can set. So to access the channel settings, you can go over here on to the information tab and then you can go for more options right here. So you can change notification for this particular channel. For example, if you don't want notification for every new message, you can simply go over here and choose, let's say just mention. So only when someone mentions you out, you get the notification. So by default, it has been set as new uh, message. So if I were to go over here, you can also mute general. So you don't want notification from general at all, then you can mute it out right here. You can also go around here, other options are there, but one of the options that you might want to work around with is renaming channel. So if you want to rename the channel, simply click on it. And let's say you want uh, from general to, uh, let's say for example, you want to rename it to public, then what you can simply do is rename the channel and the channel has been renamed to public. But this is something that should be avoided like renaming channel, if you rename the channel too much, then the participants will be confused on which channel it is about. So you can also go over here, there's manage posting permissions, which is another option. So right now what happens is that everyone can post in the channel. So every member, you can also go around and limit this to everyone except guests right here, but you can allow threads to them, or you can disable the threads as well, or you can just allow admins to post or only admins plus specific people. So you can go around and let's say admin and my other tube 2 account can post it. So once I do that, others won't be able to post it. Now, everyone else is blocked. Only the admins and the selected user are able to post it out. You can also go around here on to additional options to find the same options. For example, you can go to manage posting permission right here. You have the access to the same setting. Let's go to additional options. You can rename the channel and you can set the channel description over here as well. So right from over here, you can go around, work around with the description from the top, just like that, or go around into more settings right over here. So that is how you can set up channel options inside of Slack. So hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.